broken like the first morning. Blackbird has spoken like. My the name is Juliet, and I'm from uh, Marrowfoot Golf Club and Wildwood Designs, and we are running an art prize competition featuring this amazing old bridge. So the bridge crosses the Cooks River between Earlwood and Marrickville. And it's actually going to be uh, changed in the next uh, six months or so, so mid-2014. Uh, there'll be a new bridge, it'll be more modern, it'll be wonderful of course, but we, what we wanted to do is preserve the memories of this old incredible bridge. So um, we're going to show you some art, uh, some photos of the angles of the bridge, the perspectives that you might like to take. First grass, praise for the sweetness of the red garden, sprung in completeness where his feet So this is the bridge that we want you to paint uh, one more time and from another perspective. This perspective is looking up at the bridge which is what the people in Earlwood see or anybody who walks along this path sees and enjoys every time they do this beautiful walk along the Cooks River. When the sun beats down and burns the tar up on the roof And your shoes get so hot you wish your tired feet were fireproof Other famous artists that have painted bridges include Monet and uh, another Australian favourite of mine is a fella called Jasper Knight where he paints beautiful pillars um, on recycled materials from house paint and bridge pillars and they're wonderful. So another idea you could do is Google bridge paintings or pillar paintings and just see what artists around the world are doing to represent bridges in their community. Another boardwalk We'll be falling in love Another boardwalk Boardwalk From the park here The happy sounds of a carousel Almost taste the hot dog and fries. We would like submitted includes photography, paintings, drawings, mixed media, sculpture, but as long as it's hangable and the size has to be no more than a metre by metre. It's going to be $10 to enter and the, the art prize is open to the whole community, but the bridge has to be in all the pieces. So the artwork we're hoping we're going to put on this fence for the for one day, it'll be a Friday, and we'll have a celebration on the course where we shut the first hole off from about four o'clock and the community can mingle amongst the art. I'll just show you the fence. Uh, yeah, so we're hoping that the artwork can go on this fence here, which protects uh, people from golf balls. Uh, but it ought, So it's a good spot for um, an outdoor art show, as long as it's not raining. And if it is raining, we'll have all the artwork in the club. After the Friday, we'll have the artwork in the clubhouse for people to uh, buy and look at. Uh, some pieces the club would probably like to keep because it, it, make, it decorates the club and then they can be for sale in the club probably for several weeks after. It should be absolutely fun. We're planning it for March uh, 2014. So it will be a wonderful competition and we're hoping that you all will enter or if you don't enter, come along and buy.